If you could think of one food that comes to mind during October when it's nice and cool outside and you're thinking about pumpkins and Halloween and caramel corn, delicious homemade caramel corn. It's one of the things that I grew up with and I still to this day dream about. I'm gonna show you how to make caramel corn that's so easy and delicious, you're gonna be wondering why you haven't been making it more often. To start, you're gonna take five cups of air popped popcorn. I used about a third a cup of kernels and made it in my microwave, but you can also do it in a saute pan. Set your popcorn aside. In a large saute pan, you're gonna melt your butter and your brown sugar over medium to high heat. You're gonna cook it, stirring it continuously for six to seven minutes while it's bubbling and you're stirring as it goes. You want it to get this nice golden color. Turn off the heat from the butter mixture and then you're gonna go ahead and put in your baking soda, your salt, your vanilla extract, and keep stirring until it's thick and glossy. Pour this nice caramel mixture right on top of the popcorn in a big bowl and using a rubber spatula or a spoon, stir it continuously until all the popcorn is coated as much as possible. Now you're gonna pour the caramel coated popcorn onto a silk hat lined baking sheet. You could also use parchment paper if you didn't have a silk hat. Put the popcorn in the oven 250 degrees for about one hour. When it comes out, let it cool for a few minutes, pour it into a bowl, and what do you have? Homemade caramel corn that your family and friends are gonna go crazy for. I would say that this is gonna be gone in about 10 minutes today, so I should just go ahead and hide it maybe. For more fast, fresh, and easy recipes like this and more, check out Weelicious.com. Don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment below telling me one of your favorite things to make during the month of October.